this week I've been absolutely obsessed with the new Scott Pilgrim TV show that's come out on Netflix. It's like an animated series. I always, I, I've never been super into Scott Pilgrim. Like I've always liked it. If you're not familiar, it's a, I think it, it, it started as just a comic book series, Scott Pilgrim versus the world. Then got made in 2010 into a live action film starring Michael Cera as Scott Pilgrim. And it has now been adapted into an animated series on Netflix, which features all of the cast from the movie. So Scott Pilgrim is voiced by Michael Cera. And there's a lot of actually big name actors, voice actors in it, I guess, including Chris Evans, Brie Larson, Michael Cera, like lots of very famous people are in this series. And I think that is a real ode to how much they respected the original work that they'd all be wanting to come back to do this animated series on Netflix. I remember seeing the movie and it's basically, it's about this guy. The concept is really like, it's kind of dumb in modern days, but he meets this girl that he really, really likes. And to date her, he has to defeat her evil ex-boyfriends. And it's very video gamey inspired. So a lot of the like fight scenes and stuff are inspired by video games and uh, a lot of like, there's like power ups and level ups and KO and all this stuff. And the way the movie back then adapted all of these like video game stylistic almost and also comic booky kind of um, features was really impressive. But I got to say the way the cartoon, I've only watched a few episodes, but the way the cartoon has done it is even better. And I think it just lends itself to being an animated cartoon. Not that the live action movie wasn't good because the live action movie was great, but this cartoon is just the chillest, calmest, coolest laid back show I have ever seen. The animation style is just really, really unique in a way. And the whole thing just feels chilled out. It just feels like something you just watch when you're on the couch and you just zone out and just focus on it. Like it actually makes you focus something about the animation, like just feels like you're hooked onto this thing. It also has the soundtrack to the TV show is done by Anna Managuchi, who is an electronic uh, artist who often uses like 8-bit or video gamey sounds in their music. Uh, and the soundtrack is just incredible as well. It's like ambient, 8 bitty video gamey style music that complements it so well. And just, again, like in the first kind of fight in episode one, it kind of turns into a uh, Tekken kind of style, like fighting game, horizontal plane, health bars, KOs and stuff on screen. And it's like you're watching a video game. It is just so creative again. And as I said, with hunger games, I just get obsessed with stuff. So now I've gotten all the Scott Pilgrim comics and I'm just reading them on my iPad. And there's only six volumes. So you can smash through them. I'm already up to the third one, but this show I think is a must watch. Like I have been loving it so far, just the way it feels comic booky. It feels video gamey. It feels anime ish. It feels cartoonish. It just is a blend of all these really interesting styles of storytelling and it's very like transmedia ish i've really enjoyed it so i just wanted to recommend it on this it's on netflix definitely check it out it is such a good show 